Concilio Labs. Yeah, three minutes. Good afternoon, everyone. Can you all hear me back there okay? Awesome. All right, so I'm here to tell you a little bit about our Inside Engine product and helping hoteliers understand guests like they haven't before. So the Concilio Inside Engine product is a guest intelligence platform designed to help hoteliers understand their guests and aid them with actionable insights so that they can um, make smarter guest decisions. So as you all know, some of the big hotelier challenges that we currently have right now besides the OTAs and the Airbnbs, but currently the guests demand greater customizations and personalizations as they not only stay at the property, but throughout their booking experience as well. And the challenges are the hoteliers lack the tools or sometimes even the know-how to know how to do that. They have data in desperate places. They don't really have a way to create a simulated, um, concise way of reaching out to their guests and be able to create more bookings and generate more repeat guests. Of course, OTAs, they are able to help disperse the inventory, but they don't give much data back to the hoteliers, and that creates a little bit of a challenge as well. Um, the other thing is in the industry, some of the technology is really outdated and very labor intensive, so we're here to solve that. The other thing that we've noticed is that there, is, there are different market needs to the different types of travelers that are out there. And it's really important that we differentiate them. Understanding how to appeal to a Gen X person is very different than millennial and obviously baby boomers. So the Concili Inside Engine, we're bringing all of those, addressing all of those hotel needs within the guest intelligence platform. So we're doing that in four ways. Collecting the data from CMS and other source data, enhancing it, then b having a way for the hoteliers to explore the data and interact with it, and of course, being able to gauge with them. So our value proposition is being able to um, do this throughout the entire booking process, from shopping all the way to checkout. The three main uh, hoteliers that we target are obviously executives, people in the C-level, marketers, the impact interaction with uh, guests, and obviously operations. Success story, one of our um, pilot customers right now have been using the Inside Engine, have been able to create some of these personalized experiences and also um, in increase some of their direct bookings. Team, myself, CEO co-founder, Justin Kiefer, who is our product, um, <coughs> co-founder, director of user experience, and director of delivery. But what's interesting about our backgrounds is we all come from hospitality. We came from a company called CIG Global, acquired Micro Food Products. Our competitive and that's edge. Time. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank Questions from the judges? Terry. Yes. Can you give yes. me an example of uh, an everyday way that one would customize the experience, what you've done with it specifically? Absolutely. So say that you are shopping on the uh, website of the hotel you're going to stay at next. We're able to ingest the data and push it into the website and booking path that you're shopping on or even the mobile app. And with the data from the inside engine, we're able to know who you are. We'll detect you on the website. We know who you are, and we're able to send uh, personal recommendations to you, promotions or other things that we know about you, things that we um, know about you that you've talked about on social media, and push all of that through the website or booking engine to then create that personal shopping experience for you. So if I talked about political issues on social media, what would you, what, w how would that result in, in a, a changed experience? So if the hotel had a promotion at the time or if they had a nearby museum of some sort that had um, a political museum or anything related to that, a debate that was coming up or something, they would be able to push that through the website based on the data that we have. Okay, thank you. Great presentation. Thank you. You've obviously done this before. Yeah. <laughs> um, so just so we understand the analytics side of it, the data gathering and all of that, that all exists today. Is the communication platform also in existence today? Pushing the data back out, you mean? At, well, actually doing the, yeah, like 
triggering it and then putting it as a guest experience. Yes. Okay. It's currently in development right now. It's in development? Yes. Okay. Yes. Great. How did you and your partner come together? Well, to through our experiences it? from a previous place of employment, we've heard a lot of hoteliers tell us, you know, it would be great to know who the guests are. It would be great to be able to welcome or personally greet certain guests. And as they walk through the lobby, they've, they've said to us, we don't know who our guests are. And so we wanted to solve that uh, issue. Just, just to cl clarify, did sure. you and your co-founder know each other? Yes. Uh, how long? Um, I've known them for five years, and I've hired them on as lead experience. So I've known them really well. So just a moment ago, you said something about guest recognition in yeah. the lobby, which is the first time I've heard something different from CRM. So expand upon that. Okay. How so do you find that? So when we partner, we have certain partners that partner with us to do deep end intensives or to check that we're coming in or even through geofencing. And so we have the, I don't know what they do to get through it, but we have some of these reports that are being pushed out to the GM or other um, people at the hotel. And so the other thing is we're able to touch who you are and know what you look like through your Facebook, LinkedIn, social media profiles. We're able to say welcome back, nice to see you. Um, the line is really long. Let me usher you to the bar and have a drink on us while while the line goes down the chimney. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. That was Concilio Labs.